Well, good evening, greetings, and salutations. This is Passionate Bliss. I'm here again tonight with questions, comments, and useless facts about me. But first, go to my YouTube channel, Passionate Bliss. Comment, like, subscribe, and share, and I'll talk to you over there. My full video will always be on my YouTube channel, okay? And my questions for today are these. Are you okay with setting boundaries for people? Are you okay with telling people no? Okay? And is it really a bad thing? to be selfish to a certain degree, my quote for today is this. Love yourself enough to set boundaries. Your time and your energy are precious. You teach people how to treat you by the way that you allow them to treat you, setting limits on what you will and will not accept, okay? And useless facts about me, I have been someone who struggled with setting boundaries. I have been someone who struggled with saying no. And the reason um, is, was because of fear, okay? At this point, I've come to know that it is vital for you to set boundaries for people personally, professionally, and romantically, okay? Because what happens if you don't set boundaries for people? You overextend yourself, okay? And you put yourself at a loss or in the hole, trying to meet up to an agreement that wasn't appropriate, that you should have said no to. Or you become someone who attempts to do it, can't get the job done, and you earn a reputation of someone who doesn't keep their word as someone who uh, can't keep their obligations or can't get the job done, okay? And so um, also what I've learned is that um, you need to let go of that fear of telling people no because they won't like you, okay? Um, because what I have come to know is that a lot of these people don't like you anyway. Okay, and I'm somebody who now believes that everybody is not going to like you. That's okay. I believe that you are not going to like everybody. That's okay, too. All right. And so once you become at peace with that, you become more comfortable with saying no. No is a complete sentence. Okay. And as far as setting boundaries romantically, that is something that I have come to learn to do as well. I have let go of that fear that I'm going to lose this person. If I, you know, don't go along or be agreeable or tolerate certain things, okay? And I have earned the reputation of being demanding, okay, in my relationships. And that's okay. I'll wear that. I'll wear that. Because if you don't set boundaries or make certain demands or have certain requirements, which I do, if you don't set boundaries, what you end up is with a relationship that you're miserable in. He's the only one happy in it, okay? Because you, you can't say no and you haven't set boundaries and you're doing things you just don't like. You're tolerating things that you just don't like and you make yourself miserable. Life is too short, okay? Your time and your energy is too precious to uh, tolerate things that make you miserable, okay? So romantically, set boundaries, okay? And as a side note, I will say the last man that I dated that told me I was too demanding, um, he said, uh, you know, you think these things you're demanding are reasonable, but other women aren't demanding these things. It's got nothing to do with me because a lot of women that I see in relationships or married, they are not to be envied. Because when you look at what they're tolerating and what they're doing, you know that you and I would never tolerate it, okay? Taking care of men, being beaten by men, being abused by men, physically, verbally, you know, uh, men having side babies on them. All these women that are married and in relationships, they're not to be envied because they had no boundaries. You know, some of them are miserable. Tolerating things that is just eating them alive. And he's not grateful. In the end, he'll probably leave for somebody else. So you have to set boundaries personally, professionally, romantically. And I believe in that wholeheartedly. Okay? You'll find that you're happier. You'll find that you're lighter. You're freer. And you're living your life on your terms. Okay? May everybody live their life on their terms. Y'all have sweet dreams. Wait to find them real.